my dad was, wasn't too sure what I was doing. Um, I was taking the bus to the gym, and then when I was old enough driving on my own, they were, they were really around. They came to some grappling tournaments. They've always helped, like, funding uh, trips and, and making sure I was okay and let me live at home and paying some bills. So, you know, I didn't have to kill myself working and not uh, be at the gym. Um, but they never thought I was serious. They never thought I'd be a pro athlete. And I don't think anyone ever saw me at this level, and including myself, um, you know, kind of just, just happened. Um, my mom's never watched it. She won't watch me grapple. She won't watch me fight. Doesn't matter the outcome. Doesn't matter uh, if she knows it's two seconds, five seconds. I don't get touched. She, she will watch. Um, and then my wife, uh, I met her like halfway through my career. So she's she just jumped right in and she was just used to it. She loves it. Um, and then my kids, uh, since they were born, they, uh, my daughter was three months at her first fight and my son was uh, his one month birthday. So, you know, they've been in the gym, my daughter, after about a week, just you know, we were new parents and we weren't sure about germs and stuff and how to take care of kids. And then um, my son, I think the second day uh, he was born. So they've been in the gym ever since. They've been around me training ever since um, and, and fighting. Uh, my grandfather always watched it. Uh, he just wants me to go in there and make it nice and easy and out. And um, you know, so the standpoint from the family is everyone's just kind of used to it. They got to accept it and uh, they know I do my job pretty well. So uh, thankfully I've, I haven't had too many injuries and uh, we keep it going like that. best advice you know kind of always sticks with me uh, more of a, a quote from someone and that that stuck with me for a long time and, uh, and that was hard work beats talent when talent fails to work hard and that one uh, that one always stuck always stuck with me for sure my name is Michael Imperato I'm 34 years old born in Toronto Ontario Canada I'm a professional MMA fighter and a jiu-jitsu black belt calling him back at Slammer the Hammer in 2011 in June in Hamilton where he defeated Andrew Shea and at the time ran his record to 4-1. and one. 